Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Margarita for those who don't know me and for those who do, welcome back to the Blonde Avenue, my loves. So today I am sticking with the theme of Christmas gift guides. And as you know, I've been doing an Hermes Christmas gift guide. That was the first one because I think I'm most patriotic to that brand. The next one came out as the French luxury gift guide and all the things were under $500. A lot of them were even in the $150 category. And now today, I am doing the Italiano, the Italian edition. I know a lot of the Italian brands are a lot more festive, as it were, than some of the French ones. I would say the French brands are a little bit more, I don't know how to say it, but refined. I'm not sure. So in this one, you're going to see a bit of Gucci, a bit of Fendi, which has been popping everywhere at the moment, a bit of Versace, which is a personal fave because I love that kind of Baroque look. And you'll also see some Valentino, which we will start with first. Valentino Giovanni is known as a massive one man powerhouse in the fashion world. He studied in Paris and then went back to Rome, which was his home and where he was born in 1960 and opened Valentino. He took the opulent, grandiose Parisian nature and mixed it with his Italian heritage to create the Valentino brand. And as you know, a lot of Valentino is now known for its rock stars, its rock star wallets and rock stud purses. So that is a clear way that you can go to when you're thinking of a gift guide. By the way, this gift guide is not going to have any shoes or clothes because really I don't think you can buy those for Christmas and the price point is just way too high. So let's get started with what you could get for Valentino. First thing I have is a Valentino Rockstar card holder and this one I found in a beautiful color pink. It's got the signature pyramid shaped rock studs and this wallet is actually on sale. So I've left the links down below for the items that I was able to find on sale and the other ones I've just seen in store or found online that you might be interested in. They're not exactly on sale, but it doesn't matter, does it honey? Because it's Christmas. This card was originally $590 and I managed to find it for you guys for $413. So everything in this whole haul um, gift guide is going to be around under the $500 mark. So you can go ahead and get that for somebody who loves the color pink. The Valentino Rockstar bracelet retails for $380 and I love, love, love the Rockstuds. I wear the shoe version all the time, literally all the time. It has to be one of my favorite shoes. It's so elegant, so classy, but since it's the Christmas gift guide, you can't exactly know what someone's foot is gonna fit like, even if you know their size, but this bracelet is super stunning and I found you the dusty rose pink one, so check it out below. The Valentino leather wallet. I love it in this dusty rose color again, and if you really love someone, you could probably get them the bracelet and the little wallet, which you can wear as a clutch. I'm a big fan of wearing little wallet on chains or wallets as clutches when you're going out. If you're driving there anyway, you don't need to bring a whole massive bag. This one retails for 450 and is that beautiful, smooth smooth leather with the classic rock studs around the sides. This next item is from the Resort 2019 collection, so you can buy into the Valentino new, new, new collection. And this scarf is very, very beautiful. It's got Valentino's classic bold branding on it, and it retails for $300. This is great for someone who you know what colors they like, but you don't necessarily know what they like to wear or if they need a wallet or not. Silk is always a really good way to go because a woman likes to change up her silks and her scarves and her accessories. So that one's linked below as well. If you want to go down the perfume route, Valentino does some beautiful classic scents and the Valentino Donna is a really stunning feminine fragrance and you can get 100 ml for $135. Great for a cousin or somebody who loves their perfumes. Valentino Noir is for the men in your life and it's a strong classic male scent and I really love the bottle. So if it's someone in your life who really loves that aesthetic look of black and has an appreciation for black chromes and beautiful colors like that. I think any man would love that. And another version of a man's present is a Valentino wallet. The Valentino wallet retails for $325, comes in brown and is really, really cute. So if you like a man who likes his logos, this is definitely a good way to go. Now remember, there are so many options of Valentino when it comes to the Rockstar collection. I found this bracelet for $225. It is exactly the same color as my shoes from Valentino, which is that platinum gold, and I am obsessed with it. I'm considering getting this one just to go with my shoes, so. <laughs> if you hop online, that Rockstar collection is a really, really affordable price, starting at around 190 and going upwards. But if somebody in your life likes a little bit of a rock and roll, then 
<laughs> get them one of those. Now let's get onto one of my favorite Italian designers of all time. I don't know if everybody agrees, but I love Versace, especially for Christmas. The Baroque and the bright golds and pops of are really up my alley. And I think if somebody in your family or life loves these pieces, they're going to be so excited. Not everyone gets it, but I certainly do. And this Versace gold tone signet ring with a pearl essence look online and I've linked it below. It's so gorgeous, guys. Can you believe how stunning this is? I love the Medusa heads. And as a ring, I think it looks really nice. The gold Medusa pendant earrings retail for $375 and I think would add such a nice pop to any white dress you're wearing. Wearing. If you guys are considering wearing white dresses for the holidays, this doesn't even need to be a present. This can be a present to yourself. By the way, guys, I actually bought myself a present on my husband's card because as you guys know, last year he got me a frying pan. So this year he's getting a present for me through me, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Don't leave it to chance. I've always loved the Medusa head leather belts. I think if you're wearing an all black outfit or even a black jacket, you can put one of these belts over the top. And I think it looks so classy and stunning. This one is in the platinum color and it retails for $465. So if you know someone in your life who likes uh, to add eccentric flair to their outfit, I would suggest wearing this on top of a jacket or on top of a blazer. I think when you cinch the waist in on top of a blazer, it looks so stunning. Guys, I found this really affordable gold Versace Medusa head ring for $125. It comes in a myriad of sizes. Um, if you click the link below, you will be able to find them all on there. And it's a really, really nice present. Again, for somebody who likes gold and their jewelry. Um, I know it's trending right now to have dainty pieces in gold um, when it comes to neck jewelry. So that ring would really suit and look really lovely. Versace gold Medusa studs were originally $300 five dollars but i found them online for you guys with a sale and the ones in my description box cost 247 dollars so that's quite a good discount for a pop of beautiful medusa headed studs in your ears this christmas i also found the versace versus black leather pouch with the gold writing on it i think it's good for anyone that travels in your family to just put all their things in there it's good for organization and it's good for a little makeup case that you might take when you're traveling the original price for this thing 488 dollars because it's real leather you can also use it as kind of like a wallet which would look um sorry a bag when you go out which would look really classy and very cool price i have it in my links is 244 dollars i am obsessed with the versace western belt in black with the gold hardware guys i i I'm literally obsessed. I stood in the Versace store and tried it on a hundred times. And unluckily I was with Simon who doesn't like it. So I didn't buy it. But the next time I'm in Versace, I'm definitely going to buy one of the Western belts. I'm obsessed with it. I think the price point is kind of high. So I always go for other belts. But again, I found a sale for you guys if you want to gift it to someone. The original price is $795 for the skinny version. But I found it at a discount price for $477 in the links below. Yay. In Versace, I love the home collection too. And if it's somebody who doesn't like, <coughs> I'm choking because everyone likes jewelry. If it's somebody who doesn't necessarily like jewelry or perfumes or adorning themselves, but they love their home, Versace is a really good place to go for tea sets. So tea sets retail for around $300. And I think they add a bit of a of eccentricity to your tea table. And I'm somebody who likes to collect different martini glasses and different tea sets because it just depends how you're feeling. And Versace brings the color and the juice to your tea time activities. I'm a massive fan of having ashtrays around, not because I smoke or Simon smokes. Nobody smokes in my family, but I like to have them for putting change or coins or hair safety pins. I find ashtrays are just so much better looking than, I don't know, trays or, uh, I don't know, just putting things down on the table. So I love a Medusa head ashtray and they come in different colors. I love the see-through one and that one costs $182. Who doesn't love a pair of Baroque slippers? I love the bath rose by Versace, but these slippers are so cool. So if you're kind of confused about what the person wants and loves but you know they like to cozy up at home around Christmas I think these are so cool I love the white and gold branding it's so me and these are $125 which is super duper affordable Let's get on to Fendi. Fendi has been everywhere, everywhere this past year. I think it's going to take over Gucci at some point in the everybody wearing it uh, competition. But there are some pieces in Fendi that are so stunning. I found you some really good goodies online with a sale. So that person that you're gifting won't even know how much you got it for unless they watch this video, which don't let them. So first of all, I found the Fendi Silk Monster Scarf. This one comes in their classic yellow with leather edges and finished out 
outline. The original price was $341 and I found it in a link below for you guys for around $170. This one is super cool. It would suit boys and girls. And again, you know, I like a silk scarf. I put it around my hair here and it just elevates any look or you can put it around your bag. I also found the Fendi. Ooh, lightning. Hello. I don't know what's going on. It's very tropical this time of year in Sydney. The angled hinged logo cuff by Fendi. And it's that really geometric shape of, a, oh my goodness. The gods are the gods are angry at me because I'm finding all these sales, guys. So if anyone in your family loves Fendi, it's a really good cuff to get. Again, it's my gift guide, so it's going to be in gold. I found this one on sale for you guys. The original price was $313 and I found it for $219. The lightning. Next, a card holder in brown. I don't know why I chose the brown one. I just really, really liked this tan kind of look. I really like that little door hinge handle on the item also. It retails for $278 and it's a really classic piece. Fendi is a beautiful brand when it comes to their leathers and how they just design. I think it's really, really classy when it comes to the Italian side of the brands. It's very beautiful and it's compact enough to wear in your back pocket. It has three card holds front and back and a central slot in the middle. I think it's so so pretty. Then I found the Fendista bracelet in pink and black. This one is so stunning and it's very much in this season's colors. The original price was $383 and I found a link for you guys where it costs $268. Well done me. Yay. Fendi's kind of hard to find sales on so I'm pretty proud of myself. Other options are a black wool hat which is Christmassy and if you live in a cold climate it is perfect. It retails for around $270. Then of course Fendi is famous for their monsters and if somebody loves that brand they'd love a little monster card holder it's really flat really compact and very cute and it retails for $350 one of my favorite items and this is probably what I would gift myself or order myself online is the baguette rings and they come together you wear them together this is the price for all three of them in gold silver and rose gold and they look so good again I love when the metals come together so you can mix and match your metals it's really my thing I'm in love with it this costs $450 and don't tell me you wouldn't like to find this under the tree from your loved one come on i know you would it's stunning there are also lots of options of costume jewelry and fendi and they retail from 300 to 400 upwards they're very individual very minimalistic and very cool so if versace is not your vibe when it comes to the italian collection then fendi definitely will be it's very minimalistic and charming one of my favorites is the f is fendi earring and that's one of the kind of more standout bigger pieces and you know I like gold. This one retails for $320 and if you know someone who likes asymmetrical shapes and to wear different earrings then this is the one for them. It's actually quite big. It comes about this size on the ear and it just really finishes a look. Like if I wasn't wearing this piece and I was wearing that down on the ear that my shoulder is exposed on, that would look insanely good. Fendi, well done. Last but not least is Gucci and where would we be in the Italian collection if we didn't discuss Gucci? Did you guys just see that lightning? That's the gods agreeing with me. Where would we be if we didn't discuss Gucci in the Italian collection? So first of all, let's start with the Bloom collection. I'm a big fan of it. A lot of people don't like it, but I love the Bloom on the Gucci collection. The Gucci Gigi Bloom card case comes in pink and is a really affordable price point if you want to gift it to someone. The price is $330 and it's stunning. Don't you think? Do you love all that pink there? Isn't it pretty? Then you have of course the Gigi Bloom Marmont case. I think I gifted this to one of my friends a couple of years ago. That dusty rose pink is perfection for a girly girl and all girls need a card holder. You just need one for every bag because when you take one out, you always get mixed up. So you can never have enough of those. This one retails for $300 and it's such a pretty color. The Gucci silver interlocking earrings have that classic Gucci motif. This is kind of on the demure side of Gucci. I've got the links of this one down below and it's very cool for someone who wants to be a part of the Gucci gang but doesn't necessarily want the gregarious style that they're going for at the moment. By the way, I like that word gregarious, so this is not a diss for me. I kind of like that eccentric flair. These have a really cool price point and they come in at 255. Now the Gigi Bloom pouch comes in at 475 and it's got that canvas and classic motif. But the reason I really like this one is because I would actually wear this as a little clutch in my hand, maybe on a holiday. I'm not against it. I'm a big fan of it. And I think a lot of girls would be guys if you're watching this. The Gucci Bloom perfume is a beautiful floral feminine fragrance. It comes in 100 ml for $182. And if any girl is into aesthetics and dusty pinks and roses, this is a really good one to buy for her because at the end of the day, 
most people are gonna like a fragrance even if it's not their most top fragrance I need to make a fragrance video guys I've got all these fragrance theories that I need to share with you but my theory is a fragrance is always a winner. Gucci does some wicked cool costume jewelry. Look at this lion head with the pearl as it's holding in there. I love anything catish. So this ring for $430 is awesome. If your budget is kind of going up there to 500 and you know who's someone who loves cats and lions, then why not get this one with the pearl? And if that person already has the Dior um, tribal earrings, then they'd look really cool together. I love this spiky ring with the double glass pearl. It retails for 460 again, and it's really pretty with that blush brush to brushed gold and it's not too in your face but it's still spiky and punky and cool you can also go for the metal double-sided brooch it retails for 335 dollars it's got those crystals and rhinestones and a gg classic sign this one isn't necessarily up my alley but i really do love a rhinestone and a costume piece of jewelry so i say yes to that one guys okay i need to get going I am shooting today, so I need to go. This lightning's crazy. I need to grab an umbrella, but let me know if you liked this video. I hope you did because Italian brands are really fun and I feel very, very Christmassy. So there's definitely an audience for them, a massive one. I haven't included a lot like D&G and so many more, and I'd love to do more of these gift guides, but I think the next one I'm gonna do is maybe I'm going to do a festive guide on how to dress and sales that I've found on there and things that I might be buying because when I was on these sites, I saw some amazing, Amazing sales but they would be more so for you as opposed to gift guides because it's shoes and dresses and I definitely need to get my hands on them and I want to share that with you so let me know if you want to see that in the comments below and I also want to show you the shoes I'll be wearing this festive holiday season anyway guys subscribe like this video if you like this kind of content and if you don't then just let me know and say hi in the comments below anyway I love you lots like jelly tots and I'll see you in the next one guys bye